Hey, welcome to my crib. Come on in. What is going on everybody and welcome to the vlog for the week of January the 8th, 2018. I hope you guys are all doing very well and I hope you guys are having a great 2018 so far. I know that I definitely am. Anyways, in today's video I'd just like to give you all a tour of my game development setup because I've added a few new things recently and I think it's a pretty cool setup. So anyways, you may have noticed that we have kind of the main setup right here and then sort of my secondary setup over here. And so we'll be going into these a little bit more in depth. We're gonna start with the main setup and then we're gonna go over to the secondary setup because I think there's some pretty cool things on both of them here. Anyways, here we are at the main setup and the first thing you'll probably notice is this beautiful 4K display. This is the Asus PG27AQ and it's a 4K display running at 60 hertz. It's got NVIDIA G-Sync built in, IPS panel, beautiful beautiful display and it is a 27 inch monitor so there's plenty of screen real estate for game development and video editing which is what I primarily use this computer for and powering this monitor is my Asus GL 502 VS laptop it is part of the Republic of Gamer series of Asus laptops and it's a very nice laptop I've been super happy with it so far uh, the keyboard is this cool little red light up display, which is nice. Uh, screen's running at 120 hertz refresh rate, which everything looks very smooth on it. Under the hood, we have a 7th gen Intel i7 processor and an NVIDIA GTX 1070 graphics card, which has 8 gigabytes of video RAM. I got this laptop pretty recently, and I've been very happy with it so far. Uh, still kind of transitioning over from my old Asus laptop. Uh, so there's been a whole lot of files been transferring back and forth between the two. But I am starting to transition to this as my main workhorse computer and it's been handling everything that I've had to throw at it so far. Anyways, we'll move over to my keyboard over here and you may have noticed that there is something, well actually many things missing. Uh, I did the blank keycaps here on the DOS keyboard for Ultimate with the Cherry MX Blue switches. So these are the super clicky, you know, super nerdy sounding switches here. I've been super happy with this keyboard so far and surprisingly the blank keycaps haven't pissed me off too much just yet, um, but we'll see how that goes. Uh, mouse is nothing special, this is just kind of a generic Dell mouse. And lastly we have the vertical monitor over here. This is a fairly generic Dell monitor, 1080p. Um, been treating me well so far. This was kind of my main monitor before I got this big beautiful 4k one However, the stand on it wasn't super configurable So I had to make my own vertical stand here and we can go take a look around here And you'll see that I actually added in a nice little addition here um, So we have a hook for my headphones um, And they just go just on this little hook that I put on the back here Just to kind of keep the desk a little bit clean I thought it was a cool little addition, so I put it in there. Anyways, the last thing you'll notice on my desk is the Cambridge Soundworks sound system with the uh, main subwoofer sitting back here. Pretty nice setup, nothing too crazy, just something a little basic to get some music playing. Uh, also back here, of course, we have the PlayStation 4 and Nintendo Switch. Got it hooked up to the 4K display. Although neither of those two systems actually output in 4K, but it does look beautiful on this IPS panel display. Anyways, that just about does it for the main setup here. Let's move over to my kind of secondary workstation setup here. So as you'll see, I got the Sony Bravia TV sitting up there. Just a pretty basic 1080i display. Um, when there's sports games and stuff going on, I'll put these up here just while I'm working. And if there's anything that I might want to monitor, I can throw it up there super easily. And of course, it's being powered by my old Asus G55VW. I got this computer back in the summer of 2012, and it has been a great PC ever since. Um, it was definitely time for me to get an upgrade, but still, it is a very capable computer. So that's kind of what I'm using as my secondary workstation here. Anyways, you may have noticed that I have a little Dell mouse here and Lenovo keyboard. And basically what that's for is that I can use this setup as a stand-up workstation. I've kind of just put this setup together pretty recently and I thought it might be a cool idea to 
have the capabilities of a stand-up desk here. I haven't used it too much, but it definitely works if I need it to. So anyways, that's just about gonna do it for my setup. Again, we got the main setup and secondary workstations here. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like and let me know what you think of my setup down in the comment section below. Of course, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already and hope you all have a fantastic rest of your day. Peace out.